Hey Zip Kids, it's Mr. Doug. Just sitting here in my backyard, hanging out, um, enjoying some nature this afternoon, and um, thinking about all the things that we've learned in Zip this year. Uh, we've talked about who God is, and we've talked about how important it is that God wants us to know Him, that God's made Himself known um, because He wants a relationship with us. He wants us to know who He is. and. And because of that, that's so important. Who we know God to be, it affects everything about us. It affects our um, relationships. It affects what we believe. It affects how we act and the things that we do. Um, it affects the way that we pray and talk to God and how we ask God for things and how we relate to him. So it's really super important, these things that we've talked about. This year in Zip, we've been learning about who God is. God is omnipotent, which means he is all-powerful. God is omnipresent. He is everywhere, so we are never alone. God is omniscient, which means he knows everything. God is sovereign. He is in control. God is holy, which means he is perfect and unique. God is truth. We can always trust God's word, the Bible, because everything in it is true. God is righteous. God always does the right thing. There's no wrong in God. God is just, which means he's always fair. God is love. He loves us no matter what. He showed us how much he loved us by sending his son Jesus. God is merciful, which means he loves us and he cares about us. God sent Jesus to pay the price for our sins. God is faithful so we can depend on God. His love never fails. God never changes. He will always be the same so we can trust him. So all 12 of these things that we've talked about are so important in how we view God and so important to remember in, um, in, in the way that we interact with God, the way that, that we um, treat him, and the way that we can trust him to treat us because we know who he is. And so I would wonder which one of those 12 um, was your favorite and can you go through those 12 and and give a simple definition of what they are so I'm excited to hear what you've learned and to see what you've learned um, and have enjoyed being with you to, to teach you and to learn together with you who God is